What's up guys, it's me, your badass host Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Brilliant Diamond walkthrough. Okay, so in our last episode, we finally won our second badge. And well, let's see. Let me let me let me let me show you guys right here, okay? I, I literally had to go. Well, I literally had to pick up my 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 uh my switch to do this, but look at this, they're shiny. Ugh! Look at that. Yes, they look shiny as hell. Anywho, like I said in the last episode, we actually won our second badge, and now it is finally time for us to actually move on into the next thing, and I, I guess there's some commotion going on. Hmm, let's see, this guy is like, hey you, yeah you trainer. Er, uh, never mind, you look tough. I won't take, um, I'll let you keep your uh, Pokemon, carry on. Seriously? Seriously? It must be that Edgar haircut, I don't know. Let's go right ahead and uh, open this up right here because now we are actually in a enabled to use the cut technique. And look at this. Our Lord and Savior Bidoof is uh, opening up everything. So let's go ahead and uh, see what is going on right here. So as you can see, we are in the Team Galactic hideout. And, well, there are people here that want to, uh, you know, want to just destroy us and all that stuff. Now, this is the wrong thing that I needed to do. Let's go right ahead and... Well, let's see. Which Pokemon could benefit the most out of this whole thing? You know what? Ultra Psycho. You know what? We're going to do that, okay? Let's talk to some people right here. Team Galactic isn't interested in the world. Our gaze is beyond the stars. Really? Welcome to Team Galactic. Are you here to donate your Pokemon? What? You're not? Then kindly get off our property. Do we have to bring the pain like we did the cycling shop manager? <laughs> pain. Ah, that's funny. Okay, so let's go right ahead and switch out our Pokemon right here, okay? It looks like a double battle. Let's go with uh, Infernomon and Ultra Psycho, ready to kick some butt, take some names. I'm just like, I'm going, bring it on. Bring it on. Just bring it. Okay, so here we go, guys. Going into the next battle. Going up against two Team Galactic Grunts. And, well, let's see what they come out with. Zubat and Wurmple, you see? You see, I picked the right Pokemon for this, uh, this whole situation right here. Look at this. Okay, so here we go. Ultra Psycho with the Psycho Cut to uh, Zubat. And, well, let's go straight for a Flame Wheel going to Wurmple. Oh, yes. Look at this. Oh, yeah. Psycho Cut does the trick. Say goodbye to our good old buddy. Well, not our good old buddy, but say goodbye to Zubat right there. And, uh, well, let's see. We got a Flame Wheel ready to go. And Flame Wheel takes care of this. Yes, sir. Look at that. Wormple is no more. Now, do these guys have extra Pokemon? I do not know. Okay, so we got ourselves experience points, and yes, he's going to be coming out with a Glammeow. I think Glammeow is a Psychic, or no, not a Psychic type Pokemon, but it is a Dark type Pokemon. So, let's go straight for the Cascoon, just to be safe about it. And let's go for a Mock Punch to this guy right here. Okay, and well, here comes a Fake Out Attack. Gets Ultra Psycho to flinch. Here it comes. And there it goes. Lemmeow defeated. Okay. Alrighty. Okay. Look at that. And, well, Ultra Psycho, of course, flinched. So, yeah, we're going to get attacked. Wow. Finally, somebody that can, is not using Harden right here. So, let's go with a Psycho Cut onto this guy right here and finish this guy off with a Flame Wheel. Here we go. Flame or, well, eh. Well, it's about to do that. So, here we go. Flame Wheel does the trick. Cascoon defeated. Yeah, buddy. Okay, alrighty. Look at that. And more experience points for all of us right there. And yes, they are not happy. They, they got meddled with. And uh, the Deer Kid just kicked their butts. That's right. Okay, alrighty. So, what's next? We're going to be going upstairs. The Cycle Shop guy is somewhere here. And I'm not going to talk to these guys. I'm, I'm only assuming that they will battle. Yeah, they, every single one of these guys will battle me. So, you know what, we're going to take up the challenge and we're going to defeat these guys. So, let's go ahead and take on another Team Galactic Grunt. And here she comes out with a Seal Coon. I'm going to come out with the man, the myth, the legend, yes, Ultra Psycho. Now, let's see. It is Christmas Eve right now as I'm, I'm, I'm playing this, guys. And, uh, yeah, having a good time, resting, relaxing, that kind of stuff. I hardly, I hardly ever get to do that, guys. I really do. I hardly ever get to do all that stuff. And, uh, you know what? Doing this is actually bringing me pretty, like a pure joy just because, you know. Kind of need an outlet. Just a little bit of an outlet. Seriously. And uh, look at that. Defeated a Cascoon and Ultra Psycho Gross to level 22. Yes, my Pokemon are getting leveled up. And she is not happy. 
Holy crud, okay. Alright, who's next? I think everybody's next, so let's go ahead and give everybody a shot at battling and stuff. Now, the one Pokemon I have yet to use is Toxic Batman, and that's because, well, well, it needs to evolve and all that stuff. So, we're going to go with Rosemont, see what happens here. Uh, we are conducting research on new forms of energy. We want to harness the mysterious power of Pokemon. Pretty cool. And Team Galactic is working hard to find a new energy source for the future. Not bad. And the uh, oh, okay, our objectives are incredible, too incredible for me to understand. I'll fight blindly to defend them, and your intrusion won't be forgiven. Man. I kind of feel like these guys are a little too, uh, culty kind of sense, you know? That kind of stuff. This guy has them all brainwashed and whatnot, so here we go, going up against a Wurmple. I may have chosen the wrong Pokemon for this. Holy crud! Let's go, Rosemon. Okay, so, let's see. What do we got? Nothing. Alright, we're gonna go with the man right here. Monfernomon. Let's go. Monfernomon ready to go. Okay. And, well, here comes the tackle attack to Inferno. And, well, let's go straight for the flame wheel. Yes. A lot of these Pokemon, or these Pokemon trainers, use the same kind of Pokemon right here. I'm like, come on, man. Use a different variety and all that stuff. Yeah. Different variety. Okay, so there we go. Getting more experience points. And he's coming out with a, uh, with a Zubat, so let's go with Electro Star right here. Now, I was... Somebody had posted on my comments right here saying, why don't you get uh, Kid Thunder now? Again, you guys seen it in the last two episodes where, yeah, I may or may not have found out about a drill going down the, uh, the, the, the grand uh, tunnels and all that stuff. Comment down below where I can find uh, Kid Thunder, because if, if that's the case, I will bring him back on the team. Hands down. Bring him back on the team. Make an all-star team out of this. And look at that. I think it's a level 19, which is pretty good. And, well, look at that. It's fighting. Oh, yeah. And, well, let's go right ahead and get the heck out of here. So, going upstairs. I believe we got some more trainers going on right here. So, let's go ahead and switch. Man, let, let, you know what? Let's go straight for Inferno Mon because... I kind of feel like there's some poison type Pokemon right here, some grass types, or, or some bug types, and well, here we have this chick, and she's like, why, thank you! We love it when people come to donate uh, their Pokemon. Eh. Yeah, don't say. Yeah, really, don't say. Okay, so here we go, going up against another Team Galactic Grunt, and well, I was correct on this one, a Whirlpool's coming out. Alrighty. Let's go. Monfernomon, ready to go. And you know what? Maybe I should change the nickname to Infernomon to Monfernomon. It seems it seems pretty natural right there. I don't know. Don't, comment down below, guys. Let me know what you guys think. And well, look at this. We have defeated this 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 guy right here. And well, it's about to come out with a Silcoon. So let's go right ahead and continue on with the battles right here. Let's go straight for a Flame Wheel. Yeah, buddy. Flame Wheel, ready to go. And there we go. Say goodbye to Silco. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. And, well, here comes another Zubat. So let's go straight up and uh, just finish him off with the Inferno Mon right here. Let's go. Um, Flame Wheel. You know, might as well use Flame Wheel just because. So here we go. Flame Wheel does the trick. Say goodbye to Zubat. Oh, uh, yes. Okay. Alrighty. And, well... There we go. Look at that. Look at that. We get some more experience points and more more money. More money's for the uh, for the uh, for the damage right here. So let's go ahead and just switch out our Pokemon right here. Okay. Let's see. Ordinary people like you can't understand Team Galactic's grand designs. Come to think of it, I don't even know what's the go what's going on. Wow. That 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 that, that kind of feels uh. I don't know. That that kind of just uh. It's kind of weird because it's like, okay, so they're serving a master, but they don't know what the grand scheme of the, the whole thing is. I'm like, how in the hell do you guys... How in the hell do you guys follow this? Or how do you... Yeah, you guys know what I'm talking about. I'm like, how in the heck do you follow a leader without knowing the, the scheme? I, I think I kind of feel like I need to know the scheme, right? I don't know. Comment down below, guys. And, well, look at that. Kadabra has been defeated. And, uh, well, look at this. Look at that. That's right. Kadabra is not going to be that strong. Holy crud. Alrighty. Let's go right ahead and 
would you look at that? We got a pink-haired lady. We all know how much I like pink-haired ladies. And, well, this is a commander right here. And she's like, uh, did you want something? How silly of me to ask. You want to free the Pokemon? Yeah, that's gonna happen. And here we go, guys. We are going up against a commander. And would you look at that? Mm, 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 mm. Commander Jupiter, ready to go, and she's coming out with her Zubat. Okay. Commander Jupiter. Okay. Let's do this. All right, Electro Star. Well, that inner focus won't will, will prevent the Intimidate, but it won't prevent this, the Spark Attack, and come on. Spark Attack finishes off Zubat right here. Look at that. Okay. All righty, look at you. And, well, there we go. More experience points, and... This guy's coming out with a, or this chick is coming out with a skunk tank, so let's go right ahead and go with Infernomon. See what that happens, and well, let's go right ahead. Infernomon, ready to go. Look at him. Ready to go, ready to kick some butt, and skunk tank. Looking like a big old bottle of farts, and well, she's looking how insolent. Take a bite of this, child. Okay. But before that, mock punch for the win. Uh oh. That wasn't strong enough. Holy crap, and well, <laughs> Feel the wrath of its farts, of its deadly farts. Holy crud, okay, so <laughs> that backfired, that backfired a lot. You're lucky you're a poison type Pokemon, so here we go, Flame Wheel. Let's get it. And uh, that takes a little bit more, and here comes a Snarl attack, and whoa, damn! This Pokemon right here is just, uh, yeah, it's lowering our special attack right there, and crap baskets on the Crapsicle Stick, so now, yeah, we're really gonna have to like, we're really gonna have to hit it hard right here. So let's go with a Fury Swipes attack, hit it multiple times. Oh, you dick! As you can see, it is well equipped. Look at this, you stinky ass Pokemon. Okay, here we go. Another one, three. Let's go. Oh, come on, three times. And here comes a Flamethrower attack. Did not see that one coming. And yes, this Pokemon is really giving us a working. Okay, alrighty. I think I know what to do right here. Flame Wheel. Mainly because it's not really a special attack, right? I don't think it's a special attack. And yeah, it's a physical attack, so... Alright, bring it on. And holy crap. Okay, so we got one good hit in us. One good hit before Monfernomon faints. So here we go. Flame Wheel for the win. Eat it. And there's the aftermath attack. It takes him with him. Good God! Good gravy. Okay, but it, it is what it is, guys. We still win. Monfernomon did what it was supposed to, and my Pokemon are growing level. And Toxic Batman wants to learn Quick Guard. What is this? Quick Guard. The user protects itself and allies priority mode moves. Okay, you know what? Not gonna do that. And well, we have defeated Commander Jupiter and losing to some mere child. Being careless cost me too much! It did. It really did. And, well, well, aren't you tough? It's okay, though. Our official Pokemon statue investigation is finished. And Mars has collected energy from the Valley Windworks. We're pretty much finished here. I'll let you in on one little thing. Our boss is researching the myths of ancient Pokemon. With the power of mythical Pokemon, we will become the ruler of Sinnoh. I suggest you keep out for Team Galactic's affairs from now on. This is your last warning. Huh, okay, last warning. And, well, let's see. I got my Clefairy back. And it's all thanks to you, but that Team Galactic. They said Clefairy come, uh, came from space. Hand it over! Their logic baffles me still. It's like they are from space. Anyways, they're gone now. Thank you very much. I, well, I can't thank you enough right now, but cruise by the cycle shop, okay? Alrighty, we're gonna go to the cycle shop. Let's go right ahead and do that. Now, are there any items right here that we can grab? No, there is no items. Okay, alrighty. Let's do this. Let's get the heck out of here. We are uh, heroes once again. You know, take care of business. And, uh, you know, we are stronger than ever. We are gonna do things. You know, we're, we're gonna do big things. Huge things. Giggity things. Alrighty, so... Now, before we do anything, let's go right ahead and go right here, because there's always an item just hidden right behind. So, here we go with Bidu. And, well, let's go right ahead and grab this item. And, yes, we have ourselves the TM-46 Thief. Awesome. Fantastic. 
gravy. Okay, so let's get the heck out of here. And let's cut this down. And let's go to the cycle shop. See what he has in store for us. Now, the Team Galactic guys are gone. So if you go right here, bam. You will see that the cycle shop owner is right there. And he's going to be like, thanks for rescuing me. I can't thank you enough. Say, let, let me give you a bike to show my gratitude. Come with me for a moment. Okay, what's the, the what are we gonna be doing here? And well, would you look at that? I thought he was gonna give us something right there. I'd like you to choose a color for your bike. Which one will it be? Well, we got the choice between blue, red, and yellow, and green. And well, thinking in shiny pearl, I'm, I've already gotten the blue one. So let's go straight for a red one right here. Look at that, guys. Red. Yes, we want the red one. Marvelous! You've chosen red, the color of passion. It calls to mind images of a flame of Charmander's tail. It's perfect for you. Okay, and look at that. We get ourselves the uh, bike right there. Look at that. Look at that. Okay. It's the latest model, so I'll read the operating manual for you. Press B to shift gears, it says. In third gear, the bike cannot reach full speed, but it will be easier to handle. In fourth gear, it can ride at full speed and climb up slopes. Your bike can take you through all sorts of towns, roads, and routes. Now get out of here and ride. Okay, alrighty, look at that. And well, here we have bike riding. The ride your bike from the back. He's uh, pockets, press B to speed up, improve the control. So, first, first is first, guys. We're gonna have to, like, really put this on our key items because, uh, yeah, I do not want to go in and out of my, my bag right here. So, let's go ahead and register this little sucker right there. And there we go, we got ourselves a bike. And. Huh. Look at that, look at that. I'm just pressing the button like crazy. Okay. Alrighty. Anywho, we got it. And that is pretty much it right there, guys. So, in the next episode, I do believe... Hold on just a sec. Yeah, we gotta tra travel south to the cycling road because, yes, there's a lot more stuff that needs to be handled. I cannot wait. It's going to be fun, guys. So thank you guys again for watching. I will see you guys in the next episode when we uh, start dominating a little bit more right here. So, yeah, I'll see you guys next time.